Good morning, I'm Karina. And I'm Tierra. Welcome, Welcome to, to Tech, Tech News Today. Today. ICC clubs were represented during all three lunches. Some of the clubs that were on display included Anime Club, Book Club, Chess Club, J Gay Straight Alliance, Photography Club, Yearbook Club, Skills, Choices, and Diversity Club. These clubs are available for people who are interested in learning more about these topics or contributing to their cause. These clubs are held after school Monday through Friday. School may have felt like it just started, but we are over five weeks into classes. Time has flown by for many, but intern progress reports have come and passed. Remember that you still have until November 9th before the first marking period ends, so keep working hard to improve your grades. The Fall Pep Rally was an energetic, school-spirited event. Students wore school colors and the cheerleaders put on a show in the gym while the football and volleyball players were introduced individually and as teams. The following Saturday, October 7th, was the homecoming football game at Corcoran's Athletic Field. It was a beautiful day and our boys fought hard but ended up losing a tough game to Homer. Spirit Week was a success. There were a lot of students that participated and went all out. Many people showed spirit by dressing up for Breast Cancer Awareness Day, Favorite Sports Team Day, Character Day, Twin Day, and lastly, ITC Day. School spirit was alive and well. It was an interesting week, but now over to Jason with more tech news. Hi guys. Hi, Hi. Jason. Coco is a new movie coming soon that you should definitely check out. The story is about a young boy named Miguel who, despite his family's generation's old ban on music, dreams of becoming an accomplished musician like his idol Ernesto de la Cruz. Desperate to prove his talent, Miguel finds himself in the stunning and colorful land of the dead. This movie will make you laugh and will give you a once-in-a-lifetime story. Viva Mexico! Interesante. On Sunday, October 1st, 2017, a gunman perched on the 32nd floor of the Las Vegas Hotel Casino unleashed a hell of bullets killing 58 people and 500 seriously injured. They are calling it the deadliest mass shooting in U.S. history. Before police could reach the mass shooter, he had already taken his life. Police found 10 guns and other items. They are still looking for evidence that led to the mass shooting. That's it for Tech News Today. See you next time for more news at the Institute of Technology at Syracuse Central.